Hello everyone and welcome back to Bell Rides. I'm host 2005 Guy for Road 2. Okay, so today we're going to con uh, continue roughly where we left off, although I had been doing a little bit on a different save uh, of the game just to figure out a little bit more and trying to get my head around the, the uh, God of the Tech Tree. Say God of because things are not un unlocking when they look like they should be unlocking, which is completely and utterly confusing the hell out of me. Um, and uh, we do find out a couple of things here and there. Also, for some reason, I kept uh, uh, misreading straps for being strap, uh, scrap. I kept saying scrap instead of strap. Um, so those are basically the couple of things that we need, but I couldn't really find them until a little ways into the video. Um, there apparently there's two ways to get the straps and uh, we'll find both ways um, within the game uh, that is up until the point that you can actually unlock and create them um, but uh, unlocking and the item required to create them that's still proving a little bit of a challenge at the moment but with that said um, i hope that everyone enjoys the upcoming video if you do please leave a like if you don't, please let me know why in the comments below. Also, if you're not subscribed already, if you're on Rumble, please hit the follow and uh, hit the like if you uh, like, uh, as well as the little bell icon to get notified when the next video or live stream goes up there. If you're on YouTube, please hit the subscribe button to help the channel grow and the little bell icon and select all to get notified when the next video or live stream goes up. Thank you all in advance for watching, and I hope that everyone enjoys the video, the videos to come, and possible live streams on the Sunday. But at the moment, I can't really guarantee it because I'm currently doing the videos for my birthday bash on the 28th of May. But with that said, thank you all in advance for watching, and uh, hope that everyone enjoys it. Everything's loading back in, so it's taking a little while. Okay, so we're back in, and um, I, I still want to change this, but uh, I've been playing around with the other save and uh, using the bigger storage. Um, apparently, the bigger storage can't um, you can't place timber in it. You can place logs and woods in it, so the sticks, but you can't place actual lumber in it for some strange reason. Um, also apparently we need to find, uh, we need to make a tool, um, tool maker I think it was called, in order to uh, make the straps. However, I have no idea how the hell we go, go do that because if we go into the, um, the tech tree, the tool maker is up here, and even though we've made the bloomery, that's still refusing to unlock, and even though the scrap itself is unlocked, so there's something really screwy going on down here. So why that has not unlocked? Uh, even though we've got the, this one done um, and everything else, um, for some reason we can't get the toolmaker unlock. So we're missing something. So the tech tree is completely and utterly um, irritating. Um, it, it's a 
It's a royal, royal nuisance. So things are unlocked uh, where they don't seem to link up. Um, apparently we can do rawhide, but we don't have the drying rack. Uh, we've got leather up here, crude fur, and we, apparently we need a panas hut. Now it could be because uh, because the hide and the fur, I think we bought one of those, didn't we? No, that was in the other save. Um, I bought one of each um, from the trader in the other save, and um, it unlocked a couple of other things. Uh, I really don't like the way I've got these, uh, these boxes over here, the way it goes in like this. Uh, it seems that the NPCs have issues uh, when placing stuff over here. They keep getting stuck on one campfire and then going, getting stuck on the other campfire. So these ones are too close together. Uh, we've got a cooking pot going up over here, but apparently if, to use the cooking pot you have to have water. Uh, so, so we have to make other things before we can even make that stuff. So, like I said, the the tech tree is completely uh, from the kingdom. completely nuts. Um, it needs a, a massive revamp, in my personal opinion. Uh, okay, so let's have a look. Oop, it's gone for the other one again. Okay, so what we need is we need to um, uh, do the mud and shovel. Uh, we need the stockpile. I don't know if we need standing torches, but we might as well do that too. Um, so let's start with the stockpile. So that's five and five. Um, that one was all food, wasn't it? Uh, I think. Yep. Uh, and we've got the lumber over there. Now I found something interesting in the uh, in the other save, uh, which may help other matters. As in, we go on there. I say we tell them to get some logs for us. And instead of doing the one off, we do top up. So they'll um, basically chop down as much as uh, required, up to twenty. And we don't have to keep doing it over and over again. So that was uh, quite a, quite a fine. Unfortunately, we can't just click in this box and then enter the figure. It'd be really nice if we could do that because it would save all this clicking on the, on the mouse. Although, I might, uh, we do have a shift click option apparently. So let's do that. Shift click. Nice. Okay, um, didn't see that. <laughs> Last time. Um, okay, so let's grab two of those. Um, and let me go over here, right? Uh, we'll drop that priority down to a four. That way, um, then they're not just standing there uh, doing absolutely nothing, and then it's basically a waste of an NPC. We also need to make some uh, rugged sh uh, sheets. Curious times we live in, with talk of wars and rebels and such. Okay, so that's that one. So let's do the top up a bit on this one as, uh, as well. So switch all these to top up. Um, we do the same over here up to So go up to, let's say, 100 of those. 
We do it up to 100 temp. We do it up to 100 blacks. And that way they're, they're just constantly grabbing them uh, when, uh, whenever. Um, because we, we go through so much flax later on, it's it's a nightmare. Um, it'll grab that one out of there. Basically all the building, uh, the vast majority of the early buildings require an absolute ton of flax. Yeah, no joke, it's uh, quite the nightmare. Okay, so let's see. Um, of course, we're not any close enough to the uh, animals at the moment. So we still need to make two rugged shirts. Let's see, do we have rugged shirts currently done? Um, on here maybe, no. Okay, so apparently we still need to unlock them. Because one that we had them unlocked. Let's have a quick peek. A good shirt. Oh, requires straps. So once again, I hit, hit the brick wall with the straps, because for the straps we require something that we don't have. And my guess is we're going to have to hunt a deer and then do it that way. Um... Let's have a look. I hear one, but I don't see it. And the problem with the audio in this game, uh, in the game at the moment, is you don't know which direction the sound um, the sound is really coming from because it will sound like it's coming from the right, but it could be on the left. Uh, it could be uh, sound could be on the left, but it could be somewhere on the right. Uh, it could sound like it's in front of you, but it's actually behind you. Uh, it's a bit of a pain, a, a bit of a nuisance. Um, so we keep hearing a a couple of animals, but we don't see them. Unless it's in there. Which it doesn't appear to be. I hope that we can uh, make a, a hunter's cabin later as well. Oh, let's pick up some flax while we're uh, trying to look for uh, um, a deer. Because again, we need an absolute ton of this stuff. Of a ton of it, there is a ton of it right here. Oops, uh, it'd be nice if I when I actually, I think what I'll do is I'll uh, change the uh, the key bindings. Hopefully, we'll open up the right one every time I click on it from my non end. Hit it as we get one more sage. Okay. Okay, 
Okay, so we've got seeds in this one. We've got hemp in that one. We've got more seeds in that one. What the heck? I'm working. Oh, that one's supposed to be flat, it's not flat seeds. Okay, so where was the sage going? Was that on the other side? Yep. And I'm just wondering about the traps. Any berries? No. Yep, the traps are all uh, sprung. Um, I've also, in the other save, I've put down a, um, a trapper. And let's just say it's not really all that worth it. Uh, because the NPCs um, leave it so long that the um, meat uh, just isn't there anymore. And the only thing that's left is the hide. Okay, uh, let's see. That may have to be single F. Okay, maybe we can find one up here somewhere then. Keeps sounding like there's one to her right continuously. It could just be background sound effects knowing my luck. Okay, there's a red blip up ahead, so that's probably wolves. Which is no good because we don't have any uh, cooked food on us currently. So let's take this meat back down below. do anything with this one. Can we dismantle this? Nope. Okay. Just have to double check. I may have had my um, headset the wrong way around. <laughs> this time. Okay, let's go and over there. The problem is that the animals can see us a lot sooner than we can see them. And it's a real pain uh, if we're actually out and about hunting. 
See, it's it sees us, but we have absolutely no idea where it is. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we have to somehow be unseen, and we, we oh, and we can't duck, which is the other really annoying thing. And now it's just running about all over the place. I don't know if that's just one or two of them. And once again, it's too dark. So I'll catch you guys in the morning. Okay, it looks like some of the clothing is uh, actually finished as well. So let's get these ones uh, on some of the characters as well as ourselves. Uh, Travelers trousers, um, but they're not that good compared to the rugged trousers, but let's uh, give them some of those as well. We've got one additional pair of shoes. And then those for the winters. Uh, and everyone's just like, God damn it. <laughs> hmm. Just uh, searching for bits and pieces. I'm and... open for business, and oh. I guarantee you won't be disappointed with what I have to offer. Because he was a dead body. Oh, we can buy scrap from him. Okay. Uh, I wonder if we need to cover this hammer for anything. Useful building, town structures, in, uh, ineffective use as a weapon. Okay. 30 gold and 75 gold. Okay. I'll have one of those. One of those. Those may be the scrap uh, No, that didn't unlock anything. Uh, I was hoping for something to be unlockable. Okay. Never mind then. I thought he might have been a dead body, but uh, maybe not. Uh oh. Looks like we have a. Um, bandit, maybe? Definitely a bandit. Ah, more scrap. So we can get scrap bandits. Okay, that's nice to know. Looks like there's two more red blips over there. Uh, let's see, what are they? Wolf, wolf. Okay. Well, one more bandit down. We've got some more practice in with the uh, um, with the bow and arrow. Okay, let's take all this stuff back to base. And uh, unfortunately, the scrap didn't unlock anything. At least it didn't look like it. Yep. Let's have a quick peek. Uh, no, okay, it didn't unlock it. Sorry, that's not the one I was looking at. That one. We still need to figure out what we need for that one. Yep. Not that. Uh, do we have any more berries? Oh, that's a pain. We'll have to come back for that uh, later on. Looks like it's only one out of three though. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, 
That's still pending. Wait. Wait. Yes. Okay. Uh, which one was this one? I think it's flat. Yep, flat. Okay, scrap. Where can we put scrap? Guess it could go into this one for the moment. Oh no, wait, that's scrap. I thought it was scrap. Okay. So we have to kill the bandits for the scraps, maybe, and then we can do it? Is that it? Uh, I guess we'll have to find that later. Okay, bandit hunting it is then. <laughs> uh, although, we're going to have to wait until this meat is done. So I'll, I'll see you guys in the morning. I'll just quickly uh, get all this uh, hunting done and I'll be right back. Okay, looks like morning is broken finally. Uh, so we're at the starting point. Uh, currently on search for some uh, some tin. Oop, there's some copper there. Um, looking for some tin, not some copper. Uh, I was hoping this one that there was going to be some tin around this somewhere. Ooh, more copper. More copper. Could be some tin around here somewhere. All we need is just one piece of tin at least. <laughs> so that we can make a tin ingot. Minimap to make sure that there's no little red blips coming up. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that there's wolves right there. Yep, speaking of the devils, there they are. They are over there. Mm. Oop, more copper. Come on, there's going to be something here. Bingo, ten. Finally, we've got one. <laughs> okay, better get the bow and arrow out just in case. Nice, bow of tin ore. Actually, is that a, yeah? Right. Well, that was a, build, uh, a building there for a moment. Quite close to that wall. Nice, more tin. That's our inventory doing. Okay. Copper.
Yeah, it should be around here somewhere. Right over there. Ah, uh, there we go. I can finally see it. I just saw, just saw its head move. Damn it. Still miss that first shot. Okay. Nice. Oh. <laughs> That's it. Uh, oh. I actually need the tin ore way more than a. Uh, well, we need we need the tin ore way more than we do the leather currently. Although that kind of meat is still much preferred to. Okay. I think we've got everything that we. I oh know, we've still got two swords left. Um, good, let's get two pelt. Okay. Let's take this back with us. There's another one over there. Okay, we'll have to take those wolves out uh, later on. And we're going to have to go after the uh, deers, elks, or whatever the heck they are uh, soon as well. Of course, without the sneaking option, it's just not <laughs> that easy to do. There's got to be a way to tell the NPCs to uh, hunt for us uh, when we give them uh, a bow, um, arrow, quill, whatever. Although for some reason they don't want to put the quill uh, on their uh, on their person, so it's a bit of a nuisance that. Oops. Uh, don't really want to add tin or to that one. Uh, oops. Okay, we're going to need some stone. Let's just put the tin ore in there for the moment. Okay, so we're going to need some sticks. And then we're going to have to cook up that ore. So I shall be back uh, in just a moment once we have that. Oh, go ahead. I really want to go after that sodding deer. Problem is trying to see it before it sees us. Such a problem, that.
Looks like the rabbit traps are all sprung. Okay, so apparently they won't respond to our um, AI NPCs. Damn it! Too far away. Just can't get that drop rate right. I know because it's food, it's just going to be a pain on us to try and find. So it will just keep running and running and running and running and running. Well, oh, pain. Well, it sounds like this. Sounds like there's another one closer. I we didn't see one. Oh, well, in that case, let's see if we can find some more bandits. Bandits or more elks. Um, actually, let's get uh, some more food going while we're at it. Oops. Uh, berries. Sound like there was one quite close again, but and of course it's once again it saw us before we saw it, so we didn't have a chance to get the bow out on time and everything else. So. It's actually very annoying about this game. <laughs> but the fact that we can't crash, we can't sneak, we can't uh, stabilize or anything like that. Uh, now, where was that the thing? The. I might have looked right here. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So let's grab those again. Do we stand left? No, we're out. Oh. So we'll have one for tin, one one for copper, and one for bronze later. But we need a couple of tin ingots, which is the uh, the problem at the moment. So that one over there requires one tin ingot. Let's see, is there anything else that we can uh, currently unlock? Oh, we still need one more log. Okay. Up our uh, health quite a bit there as well. Um, 
working with temporary dump that would uh, I guess we'll just temporarily dump it in here. The NPCs can grab it later. Let's grab some reeds so that we can get some more uh, linen going. And if we can get that uh, deer without it seeing us, that would be really nice. I don't think it's going to happen. Actually, let's have a look. Um, where is the very good money? I will move the tin and the copper up to the top. I'll do. That's top up, top up, top up. Okay, let's do it. I know we should be harvesting the rabbits up and everything else, but at the moment, two rabbits behind us must be wolves again. Let's see, have we built, uh, got anything else unlocked? Uh, mining camp, stop, oh yeah, it's not pile. We'll have to make quite a few of those later. So let's see if we can get uh, one or two more of the um, bandits. And who knows, maybe a, a deer or so, uh, one or two deers. Uh, great, there's two walls right next to each other. That's, uh, that's not very good. us. Oh, fine. Okay. Let's quickly grab another berry. Come on, berry. Nice. Okay. Copper, very nice. Okay, even though we're healing, I'd like to see what that is over there. I'm pretty sure it's bandits. And we're getting some stone. Oh no, never mind, we're full again. 
Okay, let's take all this back, drop it off, and come back for some stone and uh, more copper and stuff. So I'll quickly drop this off and I'll be right back. Okay, not quite morning yet, but it will be morning shortly. <laughs> okay, so I've got some more reeds, drop them all up in the, uh, the, the weaver thing, and uh, just making some arrows because we're going through them quite quite a bit, even though we're not hitting anything, <laughs> so it's a bit of a nuisance. Uh, also, apparently you can actually stack them up, but uh, I didn't return that this time. Um, but what we need to do is we need to work on our archery a bit. Um, I really, 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 really wish that there was a stealth option uh, in the game, as in we could sneak and I'm going to sneak up on a couple of things. But uh, unfortunately, no go at the moment. Okay, so hopefully that should help a little bit straight away there. And now all we need is the rugged shirts. Um, can we do that yet? We can do rugged trousers, but we can't do rugged shirts. Okay, what do we need to do rugged shirts? Uh, we need three straps. We've only got one, uh, two currently. Ah, so annoying. Uh, we could do a bag, uh, but we'd have to find out where we can get more straps from. Who knows, we might be able to get some straps from one of the towns or something. Uh, now where shall we put the arrows? Let's quickly do that so that we can put these boxes together. Um, I'm going to move all the um, all the plant stuff over here and then the weaver's heart as well. Uh, it will make everything just that little bit easier later. Okay, so if we do, let's say... Uh, flax here again. Are there any flax left over here? Yep. Okay, so if you do it that way. There's a massive gap in between everything, so that's not very nice. Oh well, we'll have to put up with that for the moment as well. Um, I guess we could remove that stuff, but we've already got resources in it. So that's great. Okay, so... We want flax there. This one should be hemp. And then one of the reeds. Hemp. This one reeds. Uh oh. Some more cut out? No? Something weird going on there? Okay, for some reason the screen went back and I came back on again, so probably it's close to thermal cut out. So I'm going to have to put a small cut in the video here again and uh, catch you guys uh, shortly. Um, let's quickly finish off this last box and hopefully before uh, something bad happens. Okay, so we've got our flax, our hemp, reeds, 
um, and we want seeds over here. So beet, carrot, cotton. Although, because we can't get those currently anyway, uh, let's just do the flax and the uh, sage and everything. The so flax, hemp, and sage. Come on, where is it? Sage. Okay. Um, yeah, it's a bit more gappy than I would have liked. Can we put one right here? Looks like we can. So what we could do is make this one else and just for the moment. We are getting quells of them at the moment, so um, secondary books for pelts might be uh, a good one anyway. Okay, so I'm going to have to put this wall cut here, quickly save, and I'll catch you guys in just a moment.